Hello and welcome. In this demonstration, I'm going to show how you can utilize campaigns and core metrics to figure out how well products are selling um, in your campaigns on your website. So you can see here, I have a couple campaigns, but we're going to focus on the summer deals. So I created this campaign, named it Summer Deals, and we're going to use this campaign uh, to help drive uh, the sale of furniture on the site and specifically for products. And we'll be able to use this campaign um, in some reports that we can use to figure out, you know, what's selling and, you know, what's really being uh, uh, pushed out there and, and actually sold. So what we want to do is we want to look at the activity list, which the activity list is where we define how this particular campaign is shown on the website. And in this particular case, what we want to do is we put right on the front home page, um, which is this home page deal of the week eSpot, we put these, these four products. And these four products will show right up under the deals of the week eSpot that we have on the home page. So if we actually go to the website, we can see here, this is our home page. We can see under deals of the week, here are the four products that we specified in that web activity and the customer can quickly see uh, the discounts applied. So the discount is actually being driven by this particular promotion, which is a furniture category discount. So while we are discounting all furniture on the site, we're specifically pushing these four products on the home page to help drive down the inventory for those pieces. And you can see this is a pretty basic promotion. It's a category promotion for furniture and it's essentially 20% off. So if we go back to the website and do an add to cart, and we come in here and look at the cart, the customer immediately sees that they are saving 20% on furniture and you can see it's a $52 discount. And they also get a, another promotion, which is a free gift with orders over $100, which is our uh, stainless steel coffee tumbler. So that's all great. We're not going to complete that order. What I do want to show is the core metrics integration for the campaigns. So I can come in here and right click on campaigns and I can click view campaigns report. And what this does is this launches, this does a single sign on into the core metric system out on the cloud and I can get a report for how this particular campaign is doing. So we'll wait for a second for this to come up. And you can see it launches me directly to the default view for campaigns. We do see our summer deals campaigns there. Campaign and what we can do is we can actually drill down inside of this core metrics report and see which products are actually selling the most from that particular e-spot. So you can see we've got the um, the homepage deal of the week e-spot and these are the different products, the number of clicks they're receiving, the number of orders they're receiving, and then how many how much sales per click are we actually getting. And if you'll notice, for instance, even though the Garden Arbor received 10 clicks, it actually only ended up being in four orders versus the snack table had nine clicks and generated eight orders. So this is information you can use to figure out which items you want to put inside of that eSpot to help generate sales more quickly uh, right from the home page. So that's pretty much it. There's all kinds of different reporting you can do in here. I just kind of focused on the default campaign report and you can create your own reports uh, inside of core metrics uh, for campaigns. Uh, but this is kind of the default out of the box report uh, that you get for campaigns. And you can actually compare uh, your different campaigns and how they're doing uh, against each other at any given time period. Okay, and that's, uh, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.